Hello guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another of my videos. Today I'm bringing you guys the best gin tier list in shit of life. Now, if you guys enjoy this video, hit that like button, subscribe to the for more. Let's get right into the video, guys. Alright guys, so we're going to be starting off with the Chew Tail Spirit. Now, the Chew Tail Spirit, in my opinion, is going to be in good. Now, the reason for it being in good is simply because I feel like the effect of it, it can be very useful in fights, but I don't feel like it puts it above any of the other Tailed Spirits actually on this list. I feel like the Chew Tailed Spirit, overall, is just a very good, you know, Jin to use simply because of the stat boost, but I feel like the actual effect of it is not the best that you could possibly get in a tailed spirit. Next up is going to be the guy spirit. Now, the guy spirit is overall known as one of the single best tailed spirits in the entire game. The guy tailed spirit's effect actually does almost do a full stun on, like, it's practically a stun ability. It makes it so they cannot see whatsoever and it does slow them down and it does a crap ton of damage as well simply because of the tailed beast bomb now also um it's pretty much as the same as the chew tailed when it comes to stats uh all these gins are going to be the exact same stat wise besides 10 tails the next up is going to be the icy tail spirit the icy tail spirit is going to be below the chew spirit because i feel like the icy tail spirit while it does do a lot of damage i feel like the effect of the tailed beast bomb isn't nearly as good as two tails why it's why which is why it's going to be below it on the good tier list next up is going to be core tails like core tails is going to be at the bottom really good for now the reason for this is because Core Tails does throw two be Tailed Beast Bombs, which actually does more damage than it normally do, and actually gets a new weapon spec. While compared to the rest of them, the weapon spec is basically a beam, and it is very good overall. Next up is going to be the Q-Tail Spirit. The Q-Tail Spirit is going to be above the Ice Tail Spirit and below the True Tail Spirit. Now, the reason for this is because the Ice Tail Spirit, I mean, not the Ice Tail, the Q-Tail Spirit actually does a crap ton of damage, and the Q-Tail Spirit Steam Blast does more damage than the Ice Tail Spirit Blast. However, the Ice Tail got to remember that it does slow people down from the effect next up to be mal tails now mal tails i'm gonna be putting at the bottom of good now this is actually my personal favorite tailed beast but the effect of it isn't nearly as good as any of the rest of them simply because the effect is just basically extra damage next up is gonna be rab tail now rab tail is gonna be at the top of really good now the reason for this is because the first stage z spec is practically just a better dunes fate it does an absolute metric ton of damage however you cannot fly with the rab tail spirit and that's why it's going to be in broken not in broken Next up is going to be the Sailtail Spirit. Now, the Sailtail Spirit is going to be above Guy Tails on really good and below Rab Tail. Now, the reason for this is because the Sailtail Spirit's effect is one of the single best effects in the entire game, simply because the slow on it is so immense. It's practically like a bubble slow out of a Tailed Beast Bomb, and the range on it is absolutely insane compared to Bubble. The AoE is just insane. Next up is going to be the Suntail Spirit. Suntail Spirit is going to be at the bottom of good. I feel like the Suntail Spirit is without a doubt the single worst Tailed Spirit in this entire game, besides when we get, we're about to get to it besides one tails but we'll get to that sun tailed spirit the effect of it just isn't very good uh the lava effect is hard to dictate where they're going to be when you actually throw the tailed beast bomb that's what's going to be at the bottom of good next up to be suit tail suit tail spirit is going to be the worst tailed spirit out of the entire game the suit tailed spirit effect is one of the worst because it just uh, is a blinding effect it doesn't even do extra damage it practically just blinds people and that's going to be it for the suit tailed spirit and obviously for tin tails tin tails is going to be the only tailed spirit in broken tin tailed was already broken and then they added stage three which is absolutely just an insane absurd broken ability that probably shouldn't exist in the game but for some reason they just decided to uh keep it as it is and haven't nerfed it yet anyways guys it's gonna actually be it for this video if you guys enjoyed this video hit that like button subscribe to the comment for more we'll see you next one guys bye bye